uh, let's take a look at the paper and uh, talk about the uh, uh, about the newspaper and what's what's in it today. And uh, as we get set and we'll put bring on the New York Times camera, Neil's going to show us uh, what's in the paper. I want to ask both of you about what it's like to see the print New York Times today. Uh, what was what, what had you thought where we would be with the paper by 2020 if you were looking back? And are you surprised at how uh, robust the uh, print paper still is? Yeah, I still think that the print paper has so much value. And I'm, I'm an old fashioned guy, I guess, but I love how the paper has adapted uh, and you know met, it morphed over the years, right? To, to fit the internet era. It's graphically more interesting. Uh, it's mix of stories is more interesting. The types of sections that they are, uh, you know, doing these days. Um, I love that we switched from the travel section to the at-home section during COVID because, well, everybody's at home. So let's try to figure out what we can do uh, with readers during this time. And what, a, and what a evocative picture today I, I saw on the front of that great section. So I love the print paper. There's still nothing like it in the world. And to see a story that looks really good and interesting on web in print is often such a different experience. You, you experience the story, I experience the story in a different way, just kind of tactilely and, and, and visually, and uh, even as a reading experience, I find print paper still a very different and really terrific uh, uh, way to spend my Sunday morning. And Susan, how about you? Well, look, I of course I agree. We 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 are really anachronistic in this household, I guess. You know, we still get three newspapers, print newspapers every day. Uh, the Times, of course, and also the Post and the Wall Street Journal. And you know, what I would say is that we've become, we just interact uh, with a. a, a institution like the Times in so many more ways than we did uh, a generation ago. So it's not either or, uh, print or online, but I would say that, you know, we're interacting obviously with the website all the time throughout the day, and then also experiencing the print paper uh, in a different way 